Yo, what is up everybody and welcome back to another Madden 19 Ultimate Team game. Check out this new Combine Odell Beckham Jr. that just got released today in the game. We have him powered up, we have Sprinter on him, we have Coach Madden, all sorts of chemistry boost applied. Makes this Odell look like a golden ticket. 99 speed, 99 acceleration, 99 jumping, all sorts of high 90 ratings including that catch in traffic at 96. So naturally, we're going to put this Odell on the field, see just how good he is. We're going to try to force feed the ball to Odell as you can tell so far two for two 28 yards not too bad though at the same time we're gonna have to throw the ball to other receivers if Odell is covered like on this play Odell is absolutely blanketed so we're gonna play maker Tyreek Hill lobbing that ball that ball is in the air for an eternity so I'll take the incompletion second down Odell will pretty much always be our first read this time deep post going for it all Odell can't make the catch in double coverage third down one more time looking to pass looking for Beckham he is covered now rolling with Vic, but Nadamik and Sue just chops our quarterback down, and that'll bring up a fourth down and 11. Not even gonna think about punting this ball. We're thinking about Beckham. We fired to Beckham, and we find Stefan Gilmore instead. And Gilmore almost gets a pick six right there. Thankfully, Tiger really able to force him out of bounds. And with that false start, my opponent's drive will start off at the 33 yard line. Still pretty good field position as he rolls out with Vic, and we had a ton of giants in the area, so he just gotta throw that ball away as second down to 15 one more time looking to pass looking for julio jones who makes the one-handed catch it looked like he highballed that pass when he didn't really need to nonetheless though julio jones will make that catch as he runs the ball for pretty much nothing with Le'Veon bell he's got a lot of time here on second down gonna roll out the pocket with michael vick now he's got a fire throwing to julio jones just a prayer and julio answers Man, that Julio Jones, not much you can do about him when he's on his game. Hopefully, our Odell can outmatch Julio Jones. At the same time, though, we might have to, you know, try to find other receivers as we go to Tyreek Hill, who somehow makes this catch. Not exactly like that. I want to find open receivers, not just throwing the ball to Tyreek like that, but, um... Yeah, we have to get back in this game. The last thing I want to do is get blown out because we're force feeding the ball to OBJ. Now there, Odell is actually open. He's going to bring up a third down and five as Michael Vick just going to sit fire in. Odell is open, man. We're not going to force the ball to Odell at this point, but when he's open, we're going to give him the ball. Here, that was kind of a force. I knew he would bite and we would have B wide open right there, but I had to give Odell a chance. Second down, Odell is covered. We're just going to wait, and eventually, all of a sudden, there's Odell Beckham Jr. just chilling by himself. So, hey, <laughs> we're gonna throw it to the open man and that time just happened to be number 13 this drive's going pretty well so far love to get a touchdown here as we go underneath to beckham but that ryan shazier is so fast able to cover so much of the field second down and seven end zone for beckham but that goes way too high out of bounds now third down one more time beckham is wide open that'll be a touchdown for o BJ to tie the game up. I don't know what kind of coverage came out in there, but we were able to take advantage. I don't know what kind of coverage we came out in right there. Actually, I do know we sent an all-out blitz in. He absolutely made us pay with Jerry Rice. This time, the blitz gets home. Julius Peppers, loss of 10. We come out the two-minute warning. We send the blitz one more time. He has time to fire and make the catch in traffic to Juju Smith-Schuster. Third down and two. Big play here, and he goes underneath to Le'Veon Bell. Gonna get that first down. Down. Now, minute 23 left in the first half. Just going to keep one eye on the clock right here to make sure he doesn't chew the whole thing up. We're more focused on just getting the stop right now, making sure we hold him to just a field goal. Maybe even force a turnover as he's making a lot of catches in traffic right now. There's Ricky taking the hit from Ogletree. Third down, Ricky. Unnecessary spin move, but he's going to fall forward anyways all the way to the three-yard line as we send pressure. And he just fires one up to Choo Choo. That'll be incomplete. Second down. Going to run the ball with Ricky. Trying to get Ricky his second rushing TD. That's not gonna work now he's gonna try to pass the ball here on third down and goal and michael vick just gonna walk in the end zone there wide open lane a little bit too easy and our defense is looking a little bit suspect right now that's the last thing we really want because men <laughs> i mean at the same time though we have to get into a shootout odell might be a pretty good weapon to let us go blow for blow with this guy as we just uh, accidentally run the ball michael vick here and thankful we get the fumble back i was just trying to playmaker in 
I said I accidentally went across the line of scrimmage and kind of messed that up as we fired up Beckham. Last play of the first half. Beckham went up with a one hand right there. Then it nearly got intercepted at the end of the day. We'll just start the third quarter with him having ball at the 25 yard line after the touchback. Michael Vick sitting, firing, and that will be incomplete and nearly intercepted. We nearly covered a lot of ground there with Ed Reed as second down. He's rolling with Vick. One more time, we send the blitz and he is just blocking this beautifully. His offensive line. He must have all 99s up there. I don't really know what else to say. As he just throws a prayer in double coverage. Got to be fortunate that that was just incomplete. Second down and 10. Here comes Julius Peppers. That's what we need, man. If Julius Peppers has to be the guy, so be it. Third down and 17. That'll be incomplete. I'm trying to just send blitzes at him so we can get him off the field as soon as possible. Thankfully, it worked out. Fourth down, he punts the ball. OBJ is our punt returner as well, but that doesn't really materialize into anything, so we start the drive off at the 24 yard line needing a touchdown to tie the game michael vick somehow able to catch the edge right there but once again that ryan shazier is just so fast we only get a gain of five and look like we might have gotten more second down that was a dangerous pass the girl would just fall incomplete third down and five michael vick protected and looking for beckham open he's got it and obj with that 99 speed wave goodbye no one's gonna come close and odell beckham jr with the golf clap gonna tie the game up of course with the PAT which was up and good as the kickoff goes off the upright most kickoffs you will see just go for a touchback just like that as he hits Jerry Rice on the quick pass now this guy needs to respond pretty quickly here because we're putting the pressure on him especially with Odell so He's going to have to not just score, but probably score a touchdown the way we're moving the ball on offense. Third down and two. Vic just gets the pass off to Le'Veon Bell. Actually, that might be Saquon Barkley right there. As nonetheless, is a big completion to the 48-yard line as he hands it off. And Jason Pierre-Paul makes the big tackle and bound. Next play. That's intercepted. He puts his hands in the cookie jar. And Eric Berry sees nothing but green grass ahead. It's a pick six. We're going back. Very picking on our opponent. Big game changing play right there. One more time, the blitz is sent, and when he doesn't have time, he forces reads that are not too smart. Even when he has time, he forces reads that are not too smart. And now with this lead, we are just in complete control of this game, and we can just, you know, kind of mess with him a little bit here, mix up our coverages. Hopefully, at some point, force a turnover. Second down and two. Gotta let this loose. And Michael Vick is gonna throw this ball away. 13 seconds left in the third quarter. Third down and two. Only a three man rush. Michael Vick sitting now rolling he doesn't have much time just got a fire and it's intercepted once again he puts his hands in the cookie jar this time Ed Reed gets the interception and we will start this drive off up seven in field goal range looking for Odell he's not really open Michael Vick rolling at the last second one more time Odell just has a knack for getting open once the play breaks down and that's cool with me, man. Like I said, we're not forcing the ball to here. We force it, and Beckham makes the catch. OBJ has the hat trick. I believe that's touchdown number three on the day for Odell Beckham Jr. And what a catch that was. I basketball it to the left side, so it was kind of like a high ball back shoulder fade. But let's just call a spade a spade. That was a blind read that got rewarded, and that's just Madden 19. At the same time, that's also Odell doing his thing as Sean Taylor drops the interception that was in his hands he could not make the catch instead his drive stays alive for one more play and Alec Ogletree gets the sack now fourth down and 23 we send the dogs one more time he goes corner and that was not a smart high ball because if he doesn't high ball that he might actually get the catch for the first down that was I, I'll, I'll guess we'll call it a smart high ball because if we didn't high ball it, it would have not been, uh, it would probably have been intercepted as we just are just forcing the ball to Odell at this point. Third down and 10, just gonna throw up a curl and Beckham comes down with it for the touchdown. Number four on the day for O. BJ, I saw him use it covering Odell, so I was like, you know what, he's probably gonna expect the post again, so let's just hit him on a curl route and. The rest was just up to Odell to make some freakish, ca freakish catch, which he's capable of doing as Eric Berry gets the deflection interception. Eric Berry going berry picking once again as we look for Beckham on the post. But that's not open anyways, and we get sacked for a loss of six second down and 16. One more time, Odell, yeah, Odell is covered. So try to go underneath the Todd Gurley, and I guess I should just throw him to Odell because I just 
threw it straight at him for the interception and down 21 he's you know obviously try to move this ball downfield very quickly so we're gonna skip a couple plays in his drive as he rolls out with michael vick and one more time man as i continue to send pressure i don't know what it is but he's just able to roll out every like one more time we send pressure he's got all day to throw this ball and what a dime that was to juju smith schuster so his offensive line is the real mvp problem is he's still down 14 points and he just kicked the ball deep to us even on side kick that's uh very interesting though you know the one thing that will keep him in the game is if we throw him an interception which is exactly what we do trying to playmaker odell open and instead we playmaker odell into an interception and now this game is a little bit dicey here because he is uh down 14 but he has all three of his timeouts he just used one right there though fourth down his game stays alive somehow he just got a wide open tight end i had like two yellows in the area i don't know what they were doing not covering nonetheless here he is he's got to score a touchdown as soon as possible and he is down all of his timeouts. The good news is he's in the end zone. The bad news is he needs an onside kick. The PAT up and good to make it a seven-point game. But this is where the game will pretty much be decided. Here we go onside. And Jerry Rice dives on top of that one at the 44-yard line. Though we're not going to need a ball. We are going to try to force this ball to Odell a couple more times. And that could give my opponent a chance to get back in this game. Remember, he was just down 21 points. And we are still not needing the ball. We're looking to go downfield for Odell Beckham Jr. And that's a touchdown. One-handed catch for Odell. What a throw from Vic behind the safety. And OBJ. He had to go up with one hand right there. You try to go up with two. And you probably don't come down with that. That one that was the perfect throw the perfect catch and odell with touchdown number five as i wasn't even trying to block the punt as you guys can tell i just came out in coverage and julius peppers gets running into the kicker still though my opponent i don't know what he was doing right i guess he just wanted to see if i could throw one more deep ball to odell which we could not because um his pass rush was pretty fierce. I think we got sacked like three or four times that game. Still, though, we are able to get the victory. And check out Odell's stat line. 12 catches, 240 yards, five touchdowns. One of them, a sexy one-handed snag. Leave a like on the video if you guys enjoyed this Odell Beckham Jr. highlight reel. Subscribe for more Madden 19 gameplays. And I'll catch you guys next time.